how you doing? Doing some pizza? I love pizza. Hello honey buns, it's Demi. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, or if you're just joining us now, welcome! For today's video, as you can tell by the title, I'm going to be doing a Primark haul. I haven't done a Primark haul in a very long time. You know, I just haven't really been. So, I love, love Primark, as you know, but I just, I was trying not to buy clothes and then I literally had a full wardrobe declutter. Like, I got rid of literally every piece of clothing that I owned and I decided that it just wasn't my style anymore and now I need, need new stuff. I'm probably going to have hauls coming over the next few weeks, but you just like my hauls, so hopefully that's a good thing. Primark's the first shop I went into. I got mainly basic items from Primark's, like stuff that I needed, stuff that I kind of knew I wanted. Do you know what I mean? So anyway, this is going to be my Primark haul. Like Primark hauls, make sure to give this one a thumbs up so I know to continue to do them. And yeah, leave me a comment down below on any nice staple items that you've added to your wardrobe recently. But please follow me on Instagram if you have a second. I'm really trying to grow my Instagram. I really have a passion for Instagram at the minute. Like I like going out and like doing photo shoots and putting outfits together for Instagram. Like, you know, I'm becoming an Instagram girl. But whatever the rat at tat, let's just get into the video. The first thing I got is just some jogging bottoms these are just it's a very basic item they're just in a space gray color they've just got the little tie at the front and the elastic waist they've got some little side pockets they come down like i said these are one of the items that i've actually worn actually seen on the women's section at like the back of my primer they just had like a massive stack of them so i decided to get some gray joggers i just think joggers are like a best the best thing in the world they're so comfy and it's now becoming more acceptable to wear joggers out and like it's quite trendy to do so and i'm loving it not gonna lie these are the joggers i really really like the joggers i think they're a really nice thing i definitely could have downsized in the joggers though i did get them in a size 18 but i could have done with a 16 um just because they're quite big fitting to be fair like they feel quite large fitting you really like the style of them i'm definitely going to be keeping these the next thing I got is a pair of jeans. If you've watched any of my Primark hauls, you'll know that I quite often buy Primark jeans. I'm not actually going to lie, unless it's been from a charity shop, I don't think I've ever bought jeans anywhere else before. Just because I, I just like Primark jeans. They're cheap, I think they're nice style, and they usually fit me well dark blue colour usually I would go for like really light denim colours but I decided to get the blue ones the dark blue so they're just a high waist I really like them because I have got belt hoops and I wear belts all of the time I just think a belt really pieces an outfit together um so yeah I really like these these are just again yeah basic mum jeans they do come as a high waist they've just got like the bag baggy leg whatever you want to call it and then the are just turned up at the bottom so these are the jeans i knew that i would absolutely love the jeans like i said i've bought primark jeans many a times before i really like them um this is the fit of them they're just like a mum jean style i have all these to an event i think it was last week but i really like them they've got the belt tube so i do usually wear a belt on them but yeah they're really nice i love them i like primark jeans they're very high-waisted i love a high waist because it means you can get the belt on and make your waist look really skinny so i needed quite a lot of basic items in primark that i wanted to pick up so the next thing that i got is a basic t-shirt it's just a like a medium gray it's not like dark but it's not super light it's probably the same color as my room to be fair um but this is just a gray t-shirt it's kind of cropped but i did get it in an extra large so that it's not like super cropped and it has got a turtleneck on it as well and this is oh this is charcoal mall i got it in extra large and it was four pound this is the little gray jersey top again i'm a fan it's got a turtleneck i really like the way that this one sits with the little arms um i've tucked it into the jeans just because i think it looks better that way but yeah i'm a big fan of this i haven't really got many turtleneck things i think about like half a year ago i was in a really big huff because turtleneck makers look like i've got like six chains and they still kind of do but i really like the style of them so i was like you know what i'm just gonna pick a few up and i'm just gonna have to deal with like a double chain for a day or two next thing that i got was actually in the sale because it is more of a summer item but i really liked it so this is a vest top but it's actually got like tokyo on it and then it's got like a little 
symbol thing and it's in this really nice like kind of orange burnt orange rust type of color um but yeah so it's just got the like strap arms and then it comes down it isn't cropped or anything it's full length and this was three pound but i actually got it for one pound fifty i think because it is in the sale because it's like a summer item and it should have sized down with the tokyo t-shirt because the material's kind of sticking out at the sides i didn't realize it was going to be so like loosely fitted um yeah definitely need to size down in this because i actually wouldn't wear this like it doesn't look very flattering so i think i'll probably return this and try and get the large or just return it because it doesn't look flattering like it's got side bits and it just like loosely fits it's not really fat. i thought it was going to be like tight fitting like the crew basic t-shirt but it's really not it's quite loose fitting so yeah that's a disappointment um so this is again there's just like a little spaghetti top um i really like this one though i like the color combo on it it's like red and purple so i really like that this will be quite cropped i think again i got it in an xl and this was four pound i've got a feeling this is going to be quite cropped because i think my boobs will hog a lot of the material so i think it'll be quite cropped on us God, i'm gonna lie i'm not gonna lie i'm not loving this one only because i don't like the way that the straps sit at the top um, and again it is quite long like i've actually tucked it under and it's quite long i don't know i just don't love it it's not what i envisioned and you know when you have a vision and it's not your vision and you kind of feel like Ugh! But yeah, I, do, I don't love this. Um, I just don't like the way that it sits at the top. I think because I have a larger chest, it kind of doesn't really know how to position itself. So then it positions itself like this and it just doesn't look great. So yeah, a little bit disappointed in this one. I thought it was going to be like a nice little basic item, but I'm not loving it. The next top that I got, I actually have this exact same top, but in like a blue colour. I don't think it's in my wardrobe at the minute. But I decided to pick this top up because I really like the style of the blue one and I wear it quite often. Again, I got it in a XL and this is just a little basic t-shirt but what I like about it is it's got a, like a slight v-neck to it so it's kind of cut out yeah, and I just think it's really flattering on the body this is in like a yellow purple navy striped combination and so this is the top that I already have in blue I knew that I would like this um I really like the the front of it how it kind of sits it's kind of got that slight v-neck I really like how this one sits I think it's really flattering on my body type but this is just your basic grey ribbed turtleneck top I think this is like it's just a staple isn't it like everybody has one of these in their wardrobe in fact i didn't have one of these but now i do um and yeah it's just long arms so it'll keep you warm for this type of weather and it's slightly cropped at the bottom i don't think it's going to be like ridiculously cropped because again i got it in an xl um and this one was five pounds <coughs> so this is the next basic top love this one this is a long sleeve i feel like long sleeves really flat as me because i'm a little bit conscious of my arms because they have got quite chubby and i'm not the biggest fan of them so i love a long sleeved nonetheless i like this gray top it's in a rib style i think it's really nice layered necklaces get your belt on bob's your uncle boom 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 um but yeah i'm a big fan of this i really like it thing that i got here is a t-shirt dress um no it's not i'm lying it is a long sleeved white t-shirt so i have really been wearing long sleeve t-shirts more than i ever did like i kind of was never really into long sleeve t-shirts but then like more recently i'm really into them so i wanted some basic ones to like put underneath stuff to match to pair with stuff so i have quite a few basic black ones but that's the only color i had so i decided to pick up a basic white long sleeve t-shirt for £3.50 um, and I got again this is an extra large yeah so I got the exact same t-shirt but in this kind of merle grey colour as you can see it's got like a slight pattern to it exact same but I got the grey colour as well here's another long sleeve top oh my god I was stocking up wasn't I I got this one in a pink rusty colour again extra large again £3.50 actually I think this is red yeah this actually looks red um but yeah the long sleeves they're basic items but i just think they're stable i really really like them again the arms fit fine i like it how they're kind of like figure hugging i'm not going to try the other two colors on because they're just really basic items once you've seen one you've kind of seen them all but yeah i really like the fit of these they're nice and tight fitting 
um and yeah i like the arms as well and i like the way it looks so and i think these items are really good because you can really layer them up with other things so like i went to somewhere in the city and i wore like a long sleeve top with like a shift dress and a belt and i just thought it was a really nice outfit and yeah i will continue to do that the last few bits that i got are actually cosmetic -y bits so this is um a foundation i love 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 primox foundation i think it's amazing i think it's really really well priced i think it gives my face really nice coverage um but the one i have is actually like 10 shades too dark i had i bought it when i was tanned and now i'm i like never be asked to tan so half the time it doesn't match and um, so i thought i would pick one up and more my color i don't know what the color is going to be like but this is the ivory o2 matte foundation natural color coverage um and it's oil free and this was three pound and it just looks like this i got is this plain gloss that i see and so this was one pound fifty and this just says high gloss lightweight ultra shine lip gloss now it is just clear like there's no color pigment to it but i very rarely wear matte lips at the minute it's just not my thing i love 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 gloss and i have loads of lipsticks that aren't gloss so what i do is i put a lippy on and then i put a gloss over the top to give us that gloss look um and i've seen this plain gloss and i just thought it was really good value and i thought i would give it a try but not least thing that i got from primark was a perfume now there's one reason and one reason only i bought this perfume and it's because the name of the perfume the name of the perfume is opal um it's actually opal crush but the word opal or the name opal stands out to me because i've always said from being a child that if i have a little girl i want to call her opal and i don't know why i know it's a very unusual name but i love the name opal i think it is like beautiful um and i've seen this and i kind of thought you know I need it I need it it's just a Udo toilet and it's in opal crush and it just looks like this it's in this like really nice blue bottle this was two pound and I did smell it in the shop it smells really pretty as well it smells really nice like a really fresh everyday scent so I thought you know what I'm gonna pick this up as a little treat my little handbag perfume anyway this was my Primark haul I hope you enjoyed the video maybe there's some things in here that you're gonna pick up for yourself maybe you think no and um, it was kind of more basic items just because I felt like that's what I needed at the moment and there wasn't anything that like stood out to us in Primark when I went in obviously I am gonna go back because I need to return the bodysuit and maybe some other things if they don't fit but hopefully it all does fit I, I don't know it's kind of more basic items but i thought i would show you anyway um but yeah if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below but without further ta-ta, i will let you go and i'll see you very shortly for another video bye